fighters on this television and we're backstage here in Nottingham, England with Robbie Peralta. And this interview is probably likely to take longer than Robbie's fight with Jason Young did because it ended in decisive fashion very, very early, just 23 seconds in. Robbie caught him with a huge right hand that put him down and came in for a ground and pound finish. The referee was quick to stop it because uh, he didn't want Jason to take any further damage. Robbie, thanks for joining us. Uh, I guess this is kind of a happy moment for you right now. <laughs> yes, it is. Best, uh, best knockout of your career? Yes, it is. Yeah. Talk us briefly through, and I guess it will be brief because the fight was brief, uh, how the knockout came together. I um, just set it up with a, a right body punch and the body punch uh, landed right on his body and then I came back with the left hook and a straight right and everything connected and just right and knocked him down. Did, did you watch much tape with Jason? Was there anything you saw in advance that made you think he'd be open to that kind of an attack? No, not really. I didn't really study him. I just stick to uh, what I know and what I, I'm good at doing and stick to my game plan and just follow that. Run us quickly through your, your sort of um, your training partners, your training regime. Like, do you do a lot of boxing, or are you notorious for heavy hands in the gym, anything like that? Yeah, uh, we do a lot of boxing with the boxers uh, at our gym, and then we do a lot of sparring with each other. And so, so that was a huge knockout. <laughs> Definitely one for the highlight reel. Possibly knockout of the night. However, you were the first knockout, of the first fight of the evening. So I guess the rest of the night now you're hoping for no more knockouts, right? You want every fight to end in decision. <laughs> yeah, hopefully no more knockouts. Hopefully mine's the only one tonight. So, but we'll see what happens. You got any uh, sponsors or any messages you'd like to give out, friends, fans? Yeah, first of all, I just want to thank God for just blessing me with everything and then blessing me with these opportunities. Thank the UFC for allowing me to fight for them. I think, uh, just want to thank England uh, for allowing me to fight here. And just want to thank my coaches, Johnny Hughes, uh, Lorenzo Rodriguez, um, Coach Michio Grubbs, and uh, just thank my team Explode MMA. And just want to thank my sponsors, Hayabusa, Training Mask, uh, Sampa Squaw Reservation, uh, Mario's Pool Service, uh, Rassel Chiropractic, and a Standard Process, and Agusas. And just want to thank friends and family back home in Escondido and San Pasqual Reservation for, our, for always being there and supporting me. And just want, that's it. You know, so if you're watching this on YouTube right now, if you go back to the start of that thank you list and time it, that was probably longer than the fight. <laughs> <laughs>